Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to today's maths lesson. In this lesson, we are going to introduce you to hundreds in a place value. At the end of this lesson, you will recognize the place value of each digit in a three digit number. Understand place value in three digit numbers by creating two digit numbers and placing them on a number line. For this lesson, we will need the words count, numbers, hundred, order, missing, and sequence. Let's recap how to build a number. Here we have two, two groups of 100, four tens, and four ones. Can you guess what number this is? If you've guessed that this number is 244, amazing, well done. You can take 100 away from any digit number, 3 digit number, and still have a 3 digit number. Do you think that this is correct? If you've guessed that it's not correct, well done. Because if you take 100 away from 132, we are only left with 32. And that is a two-digit number, not a, a three-digit number. So Ava is wrong. Let's look at this. We need to match these numbers to the correct drawings. So here we have 323, 223, and 232. So if you've guessed that 323 goes to this block over here, well done. Why? Because we have 100, 200, 300, and 10, 320, 321, 322, and 323. Now we have 223 and 232. We need to match them to the correct representation. If you've guessed that 223 goes to this number, excellent. And 232 goes to this number, you are a star. Let's try another one. Here we have 414, 400 and 114 and 144. If you've guessed that 414 goes to this number, this picture over here, well done. Here we have four groups of 100, 100, 200, 300, and 400. We only have one group of 10 and four ones, which matches perfectly with this number over here. If you've guessed that 140, 114, <coughs> is matched to this picture over here excellent why because here this always has one ten and here we only need one ten okay and let's look at the last one matches with the first block because here we have 100 and 10 20 30 40 41 42 43 and 44 so now we have 144 over there Try another one. Come back to see if you've matched it in the correct way. One hundred and eighty one matches to this block, one hundred and eighteen matches to this block, and eight hundred and eleven matches to this block. Okay, so let's build some numbers. Here we have 680 and 5. If we join all these numbers together, it becomes 685. What we do when we're building these numbers is we remove these zeros over here. Unless the ones unit or is 0 or they are 0 tens. Try this one. Here we have 320 and 2. If you've guessed that this makes 322, excellent job. Try another one. Here we have 900, 
40 and 7. And if you've guessed it, this makes the number 947. Super job. Now, we've built the number. Now we need to break up the number into hundreds, tens and ones. So if we break up the number 895, we would have 800, 90 and 5. Let's try another one. Here we have 456. Can you break down this number? If you broke down this number by saying 456, well done. You are correct. We have now come to the end of today's lesson. I hope you all enjoyed it. Assalamu alaikum.